One thing I get asked all the time, why are homes in the same neighborhood priced so differently? If my next door neighbor sold for this much, then my house must be worth more than that, right? Sometimes yes, that is the case, but don't assume that starting high and testing the waters is going to get you the highest price. Sometimes doing that has actually the opposite effect. In this video, I'm going to share how I determine the price of a home. Stay tuned. As an experienced listing agent in Chicagoland, I can tell you that pricing the home can be a bit like putting a puzzle together. But once the pieces are there, everything comes together to reveal a home that's priced just as it should be for buyers and for sellers. With that being said, here's how I determine the price of a home. Step one, research comparative homes. I take a deep dive into recent sales of homes that are similar to the subject. Size, location, age, and conditions are all factors I consider. I consider. Step two, factor in market conditions. Is it a buyer's market or a seller's market? I analyze trends to see how they affect supply and demand in the area. Step three, adjust for unique features. A house isn't just four walls and a roof, right? Take into account special features like an upgraded kitchen, bathrooms, a finished basement, extra bathrooms, upgraded outdoor space, etc. The less remodeling needed, the better the resale value. I also look at lot positioning and the amount of privacy the home has because not every lot is created equal in the same neighborhood. And what kind of overall curb appeal does it have? What are the school boundaries? All are factors for resale value. Step four, put it all together. Using all of this info, I create a CMA, Comparative Market Analysis Report. That helps me pinpoint the right price range for your home. Now here's the thing, pricing a home isn't an exact mathematical equation. There are lots of variables to consider, and it can be tricky to get it just right. So that's why it's so important to work with an experienced agent who's familiar with all of the homes in your neighborhood. An experienced agent can help you avoid overpricing or underpricing your home. And if you're curious about what your home is worth or how much you can afford to spend on a new one, I'd love to chat with you. DM me or drop me a comment below and I'll be in touch. Thanks for watching this episode of Jen's Trends.